And Gabriel's 1-2 pitch swung on, and that sliced in the air into left field. And back to make the catch is Fung. Nice catch there by Matty Fung. Yeah. Yeah, Pelletier bats ninth as the pitch driven down the left field side in the air. And that ball's going to land fair just inside the line. And uh, the throw in comes in towards second. Now on his way to third is Watanabe, and he dives in safely. As the one two pitch, and he swings and a chopper to short. That will get the run in up with the ball. Antonson and his throw to Hale at first to get Schweizer. When but facing left handed batters, he'll. Power up a changeup. The pitch on the way, driven to left field and well hit and gone for Michael Campania. Well, Campania seemed to know it. I mean, he left the box and just tossed his bat toward the USF first base dugout. I had to wait just a little bit to see the left fielder Kane, and I say give up on it. I don't mean that in a bad way, but just turned and watched it go. So Campania right on cue. I was talking about the home run he hit against Nevada, which just cleared the wall and left. And the pitch, Juliana, high fly ball toward the line in right. Reed, a long run, diving effort, can't get it. And the ball gets past him. Rounding third is Watanabe. He will score. Juliana touches second. He is on his way to third. He's got an RBI triple. Slides in safely there. Second triple of the game for USF. Third run of the game for USF, and it's 3-0 Dons. It's his third RBI. It's his also his first triple as a college player. Now swing ground ball to third by Rampant. And the third base, Miguelos comes home with the ball, but he throws it away, gets past the catcher, Wagner. The ball comes back to Wagner. But in a score comes Juliana. Rampant ready to go. He takes off again, and Campania swings and flies this one deep toward left field. And Michael Campania, for the second time this afternoon, hits it out just to the same spot as he did in the second inning over that 12-foot wall toward left center. And the Dons have opened it up now to 6 nothing. So back-to-back -back innings in which Campania has homered. Now with three home runs this year. Ball in left center, three ball, one strike pitch. And that is swung on in a low line in a second, but caught just on the lip of the outfield grass by Schweizer. So two out, Schweizer had to go down and crouch almost like a catcher would. To, and mostly sunny, the pitch here, and that swung on, driven toward left field. Kane on the run, and he can't get to it. The ball lands a couple of hops to the uh, scoreboard. And hustling in the second is Pelletier. So... They throw out from the belt, kicks and delivers, and then swung on and gripped right up the middle into center field, a base hit. So to the drive and infield, the Dons take advantage of that. In a score is Pelletier. Montanabe has an RBI single to center, and it's now 7 nothing USF. So two balls, one strike to count. And the pitch, and that swung on. Hit to third, gloved by Gellos. He'll have one play. And that's to Hale at first. In the score comes Watanabe. Holding at second base is Schweizer. And the 2-2 pitch. Swing and a high fly ball toward left center field. Pretty well struck. And this ball is one hop to the wall. Campania will score. Lex is going to be waved to the plate. And he will come across and score standing up. It's 10-0 USF. And it's a two-run double for C.E. Pelletier. There in just about all the way out to the mound. The 1-1. And that swung on, and a tapper to the right side, far to his right. Sue Callis up with the ball, feeds the pitcher. Brown covering, not in time. Brown had to get the ball and tried to dive into first base to apply the tag onto the bag. 